President Joe Biden has ordered retaliatory airstrikes against Iranian-backed militia groups in response to a drone attack in northern Iraq that injured three U.S. service members. The attack, claimed by the Iranian-backed militia Kadhib Hezbollah, utilized a one-way attack drone and resulted in critical injuries to one U.S. troop. Biden, alerted about the attack while spending Christmas at Camp David, swiftly ordered the Pentagon to prepare response options. Following consultations with Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin and a briefing by General C.Q. Brown, the chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, Biden opted to target three locations used by Kadhib Hezbollah. The retaliatory strikes occurred less than 13 hours after the initial attack and reportedly destroyed the targeted facilities, likely killing a number of militants. The decision to retaliate underscores the administration's commitment to protecting American personnel in the region. Tensions in the Middle East have been escalating, with Iranian-backed militia groups carrying out numerous attacks on U.S. bases in Iraq and Syria. The back and forth strikes have intensified since the October 7 Hamas attack on Israel, leading to a cycle of violence. The Biden administration, while taking measured responses, has faced criticism from some quarters for not responding more forcefully to attacks on U.S. forces. The situation reflects the broader geopolitical challenges in the region, with the U.S. seeking to prevent the Israel-Hamas conflict from triggering a wider regional war. The airstrikes aim to deter further attacks and protect U.S. interests in a complex and volatile geopolitical landscape.